interacted with them through Discord. So for me, oh. Discord was kind of like the upgrade from like MSN chat and stuff like that. It's kind of like the next evolution of that, you know? Um, so I never had like the negative with it. I also had a really, really close, small, in like close knit group. So it was never like gross or anything. It was never bad. Um, but I can imagine like if you don't start off with having like good connections, good friends, stuff like that, it could be fucking awful. <coughs> Sorry. It's dying here. Um, yeah. It also depends on like the experience that you had with it. Mm, I don't need stamina. But at the same time, like I never saw any point before streaming in having Twitter, having Instagram. Um, I had YouTube privately to watch stuff, but I didn't. I never posted anything. Um, what, else do I have? what else do I actually have at the moment? I always forget what the fuck I actually have. I don't know. Let me look at my list of whatever the fuck I've got. Give me a sec, I can't remember what links and connections and shit I've got. Yeah, that. Like, I've got... Like, I never used Twitch before streaming. I used YouTube to watch stuff. Never had TikTok. I never used TikTok before streaming. Uh, I didn't use Instagram for anything, Twitter for anything. Um, I knew about Patreon. I did have that when I was younger to try to, like, do art and stuff through. But I never really went anywhere with that because I never ended up doing commissions and shit. Um, yeah. What else I've got? I know I've got other shit. I, like, legit can't remember anything off the top of my head right now. It's one of those days. I don't know. Oops. Fine, I guess catch fire. Yeah, I don't know what else I've got, but I can't remember. The funny thing is, like, I put so much like time and effort into everything I do with streaming and stuff, and it's funny when I can't remember that I've got something, especially if like I work hard on it. Like, and then later I'll be like, why didn't I remember I had that? Like, you know, I'd love to have told people that I have this thing. Like the merch store, I forgot that that exists. <laughs> you know. Um, oops. The merch store, like the throne room, stuff like that. Like, yeah, like, not saying that those are things that I work very hard on. Well, merch store was, but like, throne room's not. But, you know, it's just like, I never would have had these beforehand. I prefer to talk with them in game, playing whatever website, whatever. That's fair. The other thing too is if the game has a really good like you know in-game proximity chat thing voice chat that's always really good can you take a decoy this holy shit jesus let's put one of those over there yeah because holy crap who is doing lightning is that my person i don't know what's going on but we got rid of that guy extra strong lightning enchanted multiple shot undead mana burn and undead Fuck's sake. No wonder. Good god. I know there's still like a couple of skeletons here. There we go. Damn, this is I difficult as. The lightning. Lightning fucking hurts like hell. It really does. Actually, I can put a helm in there. Um. Yeah, that'll be fine. Maybe. Put one of these down in here because I've got the space for it. Ah. Is there anything else in here? What was that? It is Bastard Sword. I thought I read that as Bastard Sword. I'm like, it, no, no, no. I'm just imagining things. And, nope, that's exactly what it was. Actually, let's go back since I got the portal. I might as well use it. Um, I remember that I was getting ganged up on by Discord owner and moderators that I was invited to. Because I found the service rules too extreme. Yeah, no, that's more of a case of like... Different servers have different rules and different kind of expectations and stuff like that. Um, and the rules do exist for a reason. Like, I've got... I have rules, very clear rules in mind, or at least I think they're pretty clear, about, like, what kind of comp uh, content is and isn't appropriate. And, like, if somebody's going to discuss certain topics, I would prefer 
that they keep them within, you know, the uh, specific channel, if the channel exists for them and stuff like that. That way, like, because, like, if, if I get, like, three or four people in there, well, that is a big attack rating by comparison. If I get three or four people in there talking about RimWorld, we're going to have, like, 300 plus comments in about 15 minutes, give or take. Maybe half an hour at the slowest. Um, so I want that shit to be in its own channel so that um, if anybody isn't interested in RimWorld, they can mute that channel and they'll still get communications from elsewhere. Whereas if they decide to start talking about like RimWorld in general or in IRL chat or something like that, like not IRL chat, in the IRL photos or something like that, like we're gonna lose like where the fuck all the photos are, we're gonna have like notifications popping up where they're not supposed to be like it's more so disruptive for other members it is also difficult for new people coming in as well to understand where it is and isn't you know discussion supposed to be kind of thing like if if you start talking about like rimworld in show off your pets like there's a fair chance that somebody's just going to talk about RimWorld and show off your pets to continue the conversation instead of taking it to the RimWorld channel where like if you're not interested in that you can disappear you know I've just said I find it too extreme for me because I have to be online and active at least once a week for or else I get banned from a server I'm not allowed to talk about other Minecraft YouTubers mm. so there are a lot of discords out there where they require you to be active or they will like get rid of people. There is a um, there's a feature in Discord that you can prune inactive members to keep the community from being like swollen with too many people. I believe the idea is after a certain amount of members, you have to it's either a setting or something that you have to do to be able to have more. I'm not entirely certain about that. Don't quote me on that shit. But, um, yeah, I think that there's a limit to how many you can have shit in, like, a channel sometimes. Good lord. I just need to go out to get a healed. I don't even have stuff on me that much. I just just needed to get them outside from it. Eliza's dying. My Valkyrie is dying. I was dying. Like, holy shit. We'll go back in that Great second. Animals. But yeah, no, I don't have, like, the forced activity. I try to remind people when they join that... You do not have to, like, do any kind of activity and stuff like that. You can literally just passively be in there and never talk. That's fine. A lot of people actually do that. Um, they just want to see what's going on and kind of watch what's, you know, being said and stuff. It's what they're there for. Um, but at one point I had people coming in and saying, like, really just random words like every other other day and I'm like what the fuck are you doing like, I literally asked the people I'm like the fuck are you doing and they're like oh I'm just making sure that I don't get kicked and I'm like why would you get kicked and they're like oh for inactivity I'm like man I'm not gonna kick you for not being active I encourage people to like have a fucking life and like do other stuff instead of always being here with me and stuff you know um yeah no, inactivity is fine. Jesus, I need to get this guy dead and then I'll work on the ghoul. There we go. I think... Yeah, they're dead. Kill. Cool. Let's work on you two. I don't know, give you a decoy to play with. Um, as for, like, the not talking about potentially other YouTube streamers, if you're in somebody's Discord, it's not usually okay to talk about other people's streams and stuff like that because it can come across as like self not so much self-promotion but it can come across as a workaround for self-promotion so I can see where that would be an issue because I occasionally get it with uh, people that join that intend to do like art commission stuff right and their workaround for the self-promotion rule is requesting if they can share the art that their friend made them um, or made them for a commission or something like that and the answer is always no because it's a workaround for the um uh the self-promotion rule uh so usually as soon as that's declined 
that user will usually stop doing any kind of activity immediately. And it's always really super obvious that they're only there to try to get people to do commissions and stuff like that. So, like, it, it also depends, like, what you're doing. Like, if you happen to do a few things that, like, tick off the box that go sus, 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 like, it's not helping. Um, not saying that you are on purpose or whatever, but I'm just saying, like, it may have triggered them, you know. I'll put that up there and see if we can keep it, at least for a while. But yeah, I don't know. Different servers. Different servers, different rules. A lot of them are really strict. Some of them are like, no fucks given, do whatever. I'm in a couple of those and it's goddamn chaos. Um, pure anarchy. Which works for some people. But it also means that like, I get like, random members harassing me and stuff. And I'm just in there as like, some random person. Like, not even acknowledged as a streamer and stuff. And yeah, I get harassed for all sorts of shit, and I'm like, wow. Um, I wasn't expecting that here, you know. Yeah, I understand that specifically told me why... That why would I want people who don't interact what? in it? I mean, yeah, but what about you going on vacation, then you have to inform the mods? And I'm just like, yeah, it's too extreme for me. The other thing is, if it's one of those ones where they want activity, they should make the Discord one of those ones where they get levels for um, interactions. Because what happens is the more you interact, the more your, uh, your name or whatever gets levels or points or something in Discord. And then, like, you get different roles, different colours, whatever that specify that you're a much more active user than anybody else because that encourages people to do it with a reason. Um, like not saying everybody wants the whole level system and stuff but I'm just saying that like realistically speaking if you want people to be super active that's the one that you need to set up. Like I, I legitimately just have Discord for the ability to be able to share stuff with my community in a way that's a bit easier outside of um, streaming. Like I, at one point I did try to kind of, kind of like create activity myself. Like I felt like I had to be more active than I was, especially in the early days when nothing much was going on and I only had a couple of members and stuff. And I was like, I should be doing stuff. I should be posting stuff. I should be announcing stuff or whatever more often than I was, but the fact is that as an introvert, I socially can't handle that. Um, and so I don't want to force it. I also encourage members not to force activity as well. Like I said, I prefer people to actually have a life and, you know, only hang out when they can kind of thing. So um, for anybody that is in there super active all the time, I am not. I, I will not be in there as much as that person that's super active. So it's going to be, it's kind of a bit of a letdown in that sense. I use it more of a, like a message board at this point. As in like you can leave a message or you can share a photo or like you can um, share a song or something like that you like and I will get to listen to it or see it or respond to it or whatever when I get a moment. You know, when I am awake next. Um, you know, and it's a little bit, works a little bit better for my health that way when it's a bit quieter because, um, I'm not, I'm not as stressed socially <laughs> from it. Like, I, I am still very new to all this stuff, right? I didn't know what to expect after streaming for like a couple of months, a year, a couple of years stuff like that like I'm still like what a year and a half in about that now so yeah like things change let me just grab I don't think I got space for this check that in there and I might be able to hold on to it there you go I wake up I need to have waste I will flush no oh. some pads if I can I do and flush some pads actually oh Right, I'm like yawning. <laughs> My uh, not good enough sleep is catching up to me a little bit. 
I'm fine. I just, um, the other thing too is, the funny thing I find is the more I talk, sometimes I get yawny. Oops, wrong button. Sometimes I'll like start yawning because I'm not breathing enough when I, um, when I talk a lot. Which I also didn't know that, that was a thing until I started streaming. Yes. I love coming in here. It's like, it's like a breath of fresh air, honestly. Hey, yawns as well, working to happily. No, I accidentally make black and yawn. Sorry. Um, so happily receives pets while well, seeing wolf blush get pets. No. God, too many. I would love to keep some of the stones and shit, but I don't have the room for it, honestly. Let's see. I've got. I was hoping to have some spare health, but I do not. I'm gonna have to buy one. Or I could put this up in here. I'm still trying to stockpile this stuff. Like, I don't know about mana. I feel like I'm gonna fly through that, but I feel like I'm gonna fly through health more than anything eventually. If this is only one tomb, by the way, this is taking me fucking ages. Um, I'm not saying that I was expecting this to be easy or anything, but like, I did think that I was going to be done with like almost all of the temples tonight. And now I'm starting to question it. I'm like legitimately thinking to myself, I'm like, do I have time? Because I don't know. What are you up to, Viking? Watching you. Keeping an eye on you. No worries about this. Uh, I think this is this whole place done now. Which is good. Let's go back up the top. I might actually also grab a mouthful of water while I do that. So next one up, I don't think was the square one. Mmm, tinnitus. Bliss. Sorry, I've got like a high-pitched high -pitched screech going in my ear right now. I'm just like, yeah, that's the thing. All right, let's move this over. So I'm at this one. Next one up is go. What wrong way? <laughs> Next one up is the square. We've got this two, three, four, five of them. I don't know if I'm gonna get in all five tonight. I'll try. I think I might get up to that one. It's it's twelve. Oh, wrong button. Jesus. I just want to reset the map. So what I'm thinking is I don't know how long it's taking me to go through these. But they're usually pretty, like, expansive kind of run through the Torosh's tombs, right? And I'm hoping that, oh gee, I'm hoping that they're mostly all cleared so that I can kind of just, even if I could just go down Torosh's, like, tonight or next week or something, I get a little bit antsy once it gets past midnight and I'm not, like, somewhere where I'm supposed to be. It's a really good feather wagon to have to be. I'm gonna put that in my ponytail for the moment. The um nice big black and green feather sticking out of my ponytail. It looks really nice actually. Wow. Mate. I didn't mean to open the door. I just wanted to kill the guy. I just wanted to kill the guy. No 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 no. Oh, I don't have enough mana. I've made a mistake. I did I did not want to do that. Extra strong, don't don't hit me, don't hit her. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Wrong way, that's towards enemies. <laughs> I just wanted to kill the guy. And then I accidentally opened the door. Jesus. This is absolutely chugging through my mana. Like it's great that I'm finding stuff. I don't want to get hit by these guys, they stun you. Mind you, I actually have been really good with that. I haven't been really getting hit. And it's a happy smiles. No. I saw you gave um what does he go by now? Is it Fable? Uh a feather earlier. I can't remember I think he's not fabled anymore. I don't know. Let me just take a quick look. He is Atraxia. Sorry. Yeah. I saw you gave Atraxia a feather earlier. Yeah. That was really nice. That was like a glowing green one for his birthday. I'm hoping that his birthday is like, like he said that he was already eating the cake, but he said that his birthday was tomorrow, but I've always got the problem where with time zones, I can't tell if tomorrow is like 24 hours away or if tomorrow is two hours away. 
So sometimes when somebody says that their birthday is like the next day, I'm I want to wish them happy birthday on their birthday, but I can never actually be sure that I'm wishing them, you know, their birthday when it is. It, it's really difficult. I am getting a lot better with like the different time zones and stuff like that. To a degree. To a degree. I, I remember some. I don't always remember others. Like I don't know why I don't remember Traxia's birthday. I'm pretty sure... Like for some reason I really remember Viking's birthday. Like it's ingrained in my brain for some reason. Like strongly. Um, I think it's honestly because like you came in with a party hat on. And that image will forever be in my mind. I loved it, it was great. Um, but yeah. I think everybody else is. I normally hear about it after the fact. So I tend to not be able to kind of commit it to a situation or event when my brain goes, yeah, this is when this happens. I was waiting to happily remembering. Yeah, it was pretty cute. I definitely wasn't expecting I wanted to put a party hat on you the other day on your birthday so I just put a I put a party hat emote on you in discord and uh, yeah what's it oh man I also feel like I'm like getting hungry which makes no sense because it's like only midnight a lot is going on right now for me and I don't know what the fuck is that I'm getting like I'm getting the hungries I'm getting like Painkiller should be working soon. You know what? Actually, that's what it is, isn't it? It would just be the the shoulder pain is just wearing me down. Because I was wondering why I felt like a bit worn out. Like I'm a bit tired from not like sleeping properly, but I always get a bit worn out with pain. So that's probably what's going on. Let's see if I can move some shit. I just remembered something dumb. Oh yeah. What do you remember? I can't fit that. I can fit that. Fire damage. Nice. Can I? Yes, I can. Hold on. If I had space in my inventory, I'd convert those. I put a key there, but I can put this there. There we go. Splint mail should take up almost, yeah, almost an entire thing. That'd be enough. Alright. Let's go sell this. I do like getting, like, the ethereal stuff. I just Good wish day. that... I know the whole point is it's not terrible, but still. Good day. Every time I come back into town, I turn my headset up so I can better hear it. Just because it makes me happy. I gotta fix this shit up. This is terrible. Uh, get that out of there. Put those in there. Convert that. Give me this. Alright, that ain't gonna fit there, but this, that's fine. This can fit there. I think those can go back in that. I'm gonna see if I can hold on to more health. I reckon... Fuck the mana. I know I'm gonna need it, alright? But I feel like... Fuck the mana. Let's keep the health. I'm gonna need this more. I'm gonna go through that like it's water and like... I don't know, most of my battles. Actually, see if I can put those away. Uh, yeah. I can. Nice. Um... I saw something flash up then, but my stream is still lagging behind for showing me information, so just bear with me for a moment away for. Let's see. There we go. Uh, a friend of mine hacked my account once and he changed my bio profile photo to like, yo, I'm in a rock band. What? My profile picture was fully drawing of peanut. What? He be not Baba? What the fuck is that? Is that supposed to be like a play on somebody or what? What? I'm so confused. That's hilarious though. Also kind of a dick move on your friend for hacking your account though. Realistically. Shouldn't be doing that. Um, but yeah, somebody will always do that kind of crap. Ah, oh, that's right. I'm trying to keep those. Yeah, it's fine. We'll buy more. Um, uh, it was loud. Well, that's fair. I never talked to this guy. I'm buying so much health at the moment. 
realistically. Put that in there. Put that in there. I'm trying to keep the better health and stuff as best I can. I wish he sold the um, scrolls though. I hate that they've got to like run over to this guy. And they're basically still the same shit, like I don't know why. Yes, peanut baba is supposed to be peanut butter, but poorly spelt. I actually thought it was supposed to be like a play on like, you know, Bieber. Like the singer or oh, rats. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. I was thinking it was like PB nut bitter. Uh Bieber. Oh my god, bitter. <laughs> Um, yeah, I don't know. I was thinking like it could have been like peanut butter and stuff, but it wasn't like the first thing it came to mind. I should get some peanut butter at some point though. You can tell I'm hungry. <laughs> Whenever I'm just like, I immediately think to myself, I'm like, I should buy that food. You can tell I'm hungry. Oh, electricity. This is awful. I can't tell whose fire is what. Like, some of it's mine, and some of it's his, and some of it's the guy in here. Whoa, whoa. Hold enchanted extra fast, and... Mate, stop moving. What? Oh. The parody. Got Timmy's peanut butter. I think it was a comic. Still reading. No. Yeah, no, I haven't heard of it. Mind you, I'm out of the loop for like a lot of stuff. Like somebody came in here the other day and said something like really inappropriate and it just like, it went straight over my head. Cause I'm like, I had zero context for the inappropriate joke. And I'm like, cool. I found out later, cause I caught up on my memes later. Is that? Oh yeah. Yeah, no, I haven't seen it. Ah. Oh. These guys aren't that bad, like they're slow hitting, but oh yeah, town portal. I will take that, thank you. I wonder if this is, obviously that connects, right? So let's keep going sideways instead, let's put that out there just in case. I love smashing pots, I really do. Like, what the fuck? Like, these are supposed to be some kind of... I always imagine that there's some kind of, like, historical artifact and I'm in here kicking vases over everywhere, you know? I always thought when I was younger that an urn was such a weird way of, like, referring to a vase and I had no clue until I grew a bit older that uh, urns and vases are slightly different and are used differently. So I was always like, man, why did they call it that? Like, I'd, I'd kick over like this urn and be like, I am clearly kicking vases. And it's like, no, it's actually a legit other thing. <laughs> you know? Wow, Ludo the Hunter. Stone Skin Spectral Hit. Alright. Boy, can you? Can you answer me terribly? So he will brush his face against her. No. You're being too cute, Farkin. You're being too cute and I'm like hungry and fucking can't deal. It's it's not common, by the way, it's really not that common for me to actually get hungry while I'm like five. Um, usually I get hungry like a couple of hours after stream. But I was awake for a really long time before stream tonight. So my body probably doesn't realize what fucking hour of the day it is. And it's probably like, we need food. And I'm like, you can wait. Oh, my Valkyrie's getting hurt. Hold on. There we go. I thought it was Eliza getting hurt, so I transferred health to it. And then it's like, it did nothing. And I realized that my Valkyrie was actually getting hurt. I'm like, whoops. I'm wasting health. Let's put that in there. And I could fit that. Let's put that in there. He moved over and I should be fine. Still got a little bit of room. Sorry, I just had to check on my heater for a second there. It was smelling weird. I'm gonna have to replace that. I hate replacing heaters. 
Like, they don't make really good ones these days. Like, yeah, I, I love sounding like I'm a fucking old fart every time I, like, bitch about something. <laughs> but, like, legitimately, when I got this heater, I had to, like, scour through so many fucking pages of, like, heaters and stuff listed. Uh, oh, yeah. What's the teen to 38? Nah, no, mine's still better. Um, yeah, I had to look through so many to get like a good one that was like solid. Because like you get ones that are kind of cheap. It's obviously only going to last like one season and stuff like that. I want one that lasts like a good few years at least. And um, yeah, I, I tended to find like once I finally found one, it's not only cheap and it usually lasts like a good few years, which is great. But uh, this one. I use the shit out of it. I use it for like probably eight hours a night at the moment. I don't think they're supposed to run that long. It's like the plastic around it doesn't look right. Um, and yeah, occasionally when we turn it on it smells like burnt hair. Which I honestly think is just cats shucking fur on it, to be honest. Be real there, they probably are. They probably come past, and you know how like, 